thought the movie was amazing. I had no idea how great it was going to be. Smashed it, I feel like. There's too many white people I get nervous, you know? No. I wanted to make a movie where people just scream at the theater, you know, get out the fucking house. <laughs> and I think I achieved that. It's a real being here, even with, like, you a genius, man. Y'all are, like, stars, and I'm in a movie with y'all. And then Chance is hosting this thing. It's all yeah, Chicago, South Side, the West Side. It's just, this is amazing. I'm excited. Yeah, this is dope. <laughs> what? Do they know I'm black? Should they? Jordan, when did you start writing the film? When President Obama was elected, we entered this era that I call the post-racial lie. We got a black president, it's done, we're past it. And many of us know that race is very much uh, alive and racism is very much alive. And it's this monster that, that was kind of simmering underneath the surface of the country for a while. And so I felt like this movie um, was originally meant to address that and to, like, and to call it out. Um, and, uh, you know, now we live in a completely different era, and it, it's been just, it's been fascinating to see how this movie's journey ha has led up to this m moment where now I feel like it's more uh, relevant in a way than ever. That's a great answer. There you go. <laughs> so you guys coming up from the city? Yeah, we're just heading up for the weekend. Can I see your license, please? He wasn't driving. I didn't ask who was driving, I asked to see his ID. Daniel, how did you get involved in the project and what about the project uh, interested you? It really resonated with me. It was what racism feels like. Because it's, it's like, it kind of that paranoia when you're in a room full of white people and you're like, mmm, something's off. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's off. No one's saying anything. Allison, how did it feel to be... I that mean, white girl that was in the I'm movie. so proud. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to do something kind of more, um, I don't know, that would piss people off a little bit and actually get people to talk. We're thrilled to have you up here for the, for yeah. the big get-together. Are you ready for this? How bad can it be? In horror movies, there's like always some shit to be afraid of. Why the psychology aspect of it? I'm a big horror fan, and I feel like all the great horror films have something to say. They have a real horror that they're about. And I felt like it, the, the, the issue of racism and the, the psychology of racism had been ignored in this genre. And I feel like, I feel like this is, it's meant to be a, a fill in a gap. It's meant to fill in this missing piece of the conversation. Through story and entertainment, I feel like we, we often neglect one of the most powerful ways we can communicate. And right now, I feel like the way we talk about race in this country is broken. And, you know, I don't know, maybe this will fuck shit up in the wrong way. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> but I do feel like art and communication is like, that's, that's the, the one tool we have against the true horrors of the world, which, which, is, which is violence. So I, I, I hope that this is an inclusive... Uh, experience, and I hope it's something that uh, inspires people to just just talk. Good to see no brother around here. Get out! Sorry, man. Get out! Yo, black people were very loyal horror movie fans. We love to yell what people should do at the screen especially when they're not, you know, they don't, they don't do it. Over time, we have, in our own way, been... We, we've been in this dark space yelling at this screen, and we can't affect the fucking bullshit that's happening on the other side of it. So... That's deep. You like and that? then when you add it to watching the news today, like, I've been thinking about this, so I feel like... Everyone feels like they're there right now. We're also in need right now for things that are br gonna bring us together as people. Um, so hopefully this movie creates a collective kind of creative catharsis in a way. A CCC, trademark. <laughs> it's an amazing movie. Thank, Thank you, you guys so Thank much. You've been chosen, Chris. Oh, you gotta go right now. Is something wrong? No. Oh!